A warm wind's down, tap under cloudy skies, but those clouds will do little in hampering the daytime run. 87 degrees, well above our seasonal trend, that would be 72, and it puts us about a degree shy of our record range. We'll check that number here in just a moment, but the clouds will be more pronounced this afternoon compared to our sun, giving us some partly sunny skies. Here's what you can expect for today. Daytime highs taking us to the upper 80s, a degree shy of the records. Arlington could set some new ground, and St. Simons will come shy by about 5 degrees, although Alma yesterday did set some records, and we've had them during the week, even our warm morning lows. Now you see the mess that's to our north, possible severe weather here anywhere between Oklahoma, Arkansas, all the way back through Tennessee, the Virginias, the Carolinas, and Kentucky included. And they could also see some of the flooding rainfall. Meanwhile, for us, it's the tail end of the front. And what we'll see measurably will be very little in the way of rainfall. I think more notably will be the wind that will be increasing here all day Friday with what could be some wind advisories. 20 to 30 mile an hour sustained winds gusting beyond 40 miles an hour at times. That leads to what will be a breezy start to Saturday chance for some showers early in the morning is 40 percent and although the values taper off the better chances at least in the model data here has some of these showers even some isolated storms coming through during the day evening and then tapering for what will be a pleasant Sunday daytime highs in the upper 70s a nice northeasterly flow maybe some open window weather there and on Monday as temperatures climb back to the 80s on Tuesday weather authority forecast always a click away at news for jacks